हरे कृष्णा सी फेलियर एज अ प्रैक्टिकल प्रॉब्लम नॉट एन एग्जिस्टेंशियल प्रॉब्लम वी ऑल विल एनकाउंटर फेलियर इन आर लाइफ सम टाइम ऑफ द अदर इन वन और द अदर एक्टिविटी दैट वी आर डूइंग मे बी इन आर स्कूल इन आर जॉब्स इन आर फैमिली रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटीज वेन सच फेलियर कम्स हाउ वी रिस्पॉन्ड टू इट विल डिटर्मिन whether we grow through the failure or we get crushed by the failure and how we respond to the failure will depend on how we see it we see things not just based on how they are but based on our conception and expectation of how they are meant to be if somebody has wedded their whole life to say passing a particular exam or getting a particular degree and if their sense of self identity and self worth comes from success in that field then if they don't get it they will be devastated they'll be shattered sometimes on failing in an important exam student students may commit suicide sometimes even the fear of failing in that exam may make them commit suicide why is that because they are seeing failure not as a practical problem okay i couldn't pass this exam what should i do now maybe i need to prepare better or maybe i need to choose some other course of action for my life but they don't see it as a practical problem they see it as a existential problem that they have identified their the worth of their existence with success in that endeavor and this kind of excessive attachment can make us battered and shattered by life's ups and downs the bhagavad gita protects us from such battering and shattering by helping us to understand that our self identity is indestructible we are souls who are eternal parts of god and he loves us and cares for us irrespective of whatever happens in our life when we understand our spiritual identity and by spiritual practice become situated in that spiritual identity then life's ups and downs won't shake us that much in the bhagavad gita 5.20 it is said na praharishet priyam prapya nodvijet prapya cha priyam sthira buddhir asam mudho brahma vid brahmani sthitah it says the those who are brahma vid brahmani sthitah those who know about their spiritual identity and those who are situated in their spiritual identity they are not elated when there is pleasure and they are not devastated dejected when there is pain they say they are asamudho undeluded and thus they can progress in their lives similarly if we by understanding the bhagavad gita and practicing the process of yoga especially bhakti yoga taught in the bhagavad gita if we become situated in our spiritual identity then we too will be able to respond to failure maturely seeing it as a practical problem and by staying calm internally we will respond at a practical level to deal with it without being discouraged or devastated internally thank you hare krishna